Hello everyone who works my channel. Today I'm doing a reading for single Scorpios, and keep in mind that this will not resonate for all of you. If you'd like a personal reading, I'll leave that description down below. Another thing you do is we have memberships on the channel, so you go ahead and join, become a member, get access to all those perks, okay? So, on the bottom of the deck, for the overall energy, for your current situation, we have the Six of Swords Averse, okay? Six of Swords Averse is like the refusal to move on from a situation. I don't know if you're doing that. Maybe someone in your life, like that you dealt with, is not moving on from you. Either way, let's get into it. Now the Ace of Swords, the Temperance card, this is Sagittarius energy, Knight of Swords, Temperance is in reverse, so we have the Six of Cups, Judgment reverse, Nine of Cups reverse, Seven of Pentacles reverse. Scorpio, there's someone from your past that you are ignoring, they're ignoring you. You felt like this person was a waste of your time. I'm I'm gonna put this one of two ways, and you can, you know, it resonates how it resonates. So, either there's a person in your past that you still think about that you can't let go. You felt disappointed how things went out between you, and you felt like you wasted your time, or this person feels that way about you. They want to speak to you. Impatient to speak to you. Oh, Scorpio, got this person impatient to speak to you. You realize how, how frustrated they feel right now? Hmm. So, what's coming towards you? We have the Ten of Wands. Okay, Ten of Wands. That is, unfortunately, the burden card. So we have the Ace of Wands, the Star card, this is Aquarius energy, King of Wands, Fire energy, Justice card, Libra energy, the Strength card, Leo energy, so Fire, Big Fire, Leo, Libra, Aquarius. You do have someone coming in your life. Could be with those placements. Could be some of you already know this person. Could be a new start between you or something getting started between you. Others of you, this person is coming into your life. Okay, so let's have a look at the messages for you. We have number eight with false person. Okay, so that's another thing I want to discuss here. This card here and false. Um, yeah, it's a false person and this justice card. So. Scorpio, if someone wasn't really right to you, if they're fake or they did something that just was not good, they're going to be getting their karma. Okay, so whoever was, whoever that person was. We have healing family issues. Worth waiting for. Let your friends help you. Feminine. Home. Observe, mirroring. Okay, so you're you kind of have someone coming into your life or already around you. I don't, I'm not sure, but this is you two are going to be mirroring one another. Um, they could observe you in some way. So healing family issues. So they may have family issues, or you do, either way. That, that's not the main thing that I want to focus on. But this person is going to be someone that's worth your time here, with worth waiting for, and you two are going to be marrying each other a lot with this. And you also have home. So it's like a sense of almost belonging. You know? It's not a bad person coming your way. I don't get that. I feel like you dealt with 
bad people in the past, but I don't get that this person is like that. Okay, so, Scorpio, that is all I have for you. Let me know if that resonates. I'm still laughing about <laughs> your current situation. You have someone in your energy that is frustrated that you are not speaking to them. It's like it... <laughs> this, is <laughs> this is something that is funny to me. So, Scorpio, that is all I have for you. Let me know if that resonates. Thank you for watching. If you want to see more content, don't forget to like, subscribe. Bye, guys.